I love the script. When I, I sat down, I was just going to skim it and see what it was up um, or see what the gist was. And I ended up reading it uh, page to page and just was got through it in record time. And then I reread it over and over again. And I was just in love. And I was like, I have to be part of this story. Yeah, there, I'd be lying if I said there wasn't, you know, some fear and some nervousness and even now, you know, some there's some nervousness, but um, but I'm very very glad that that it was made and that I tr I, I just I trusted Leah and I trusted Natalia and their knowledge and creativity and and I'm I'm really glad I did. Well, when when you meet the character, what was clear in the script was that you know she she she's already struggling with with very you know typical things, um, finding out who you are and, and where you are in life, and, and, and she's struggling with artistic inspiration. And so this horrible event happens, um, and she finds a way to, to, with her tra like to, to heal her trauma through her art. And I think that that's something that I believe that art can be. And uh, there's, yeah, the, there's, there's a couple different shifts. I had committed to it, so there wasn't, you know, hesitancy, but uh, it was it was very vulnerable and emotional, but it was, you know, it, there was a clear intent um, and a reason to do it. Those are just the stories that I'm drawn to, I think, um, and I think they're rare, but uh, the first you know, the first film I did it was it was a it was a western, and, and there was a female protagonist at the end that was very unexpected. And so, this was um, this falls into uh, breaking the mold of, of of female characters that that I've seen, and and it was just it just just felt like a very real and honest story, but also fun. My mom just saw it. My dad hasn't seen it. It was funny because we ended up. Uh, one of the girls, Jordan, um, who was working on the film, we, we, you know, she was going to school and working on it. And, you know, it was such a passion project for everyone. And she told me that her dad, she gets her work ethic from her dad. And that's something that I really, you know, love about my dad, too, is his work ethic. And, and she said that his dad, or that her dad became a cop because of Dirty Harry. And so he's actually in the movie all the cops in the end, they're all real cops. And they all came down and like really arrested, yeah, arrest, you know, did the cop protocol and all that stuff. So that was really cool. I felt a obligation and a pressure to, one, push myself to, to do the best job that I possibly could. Um, and I, I, yeah, I just, I, 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 I felt a, a, a very, I felt like it, it was a responsibility to, to, to give it a hundred percent just because, you know, I've, I've been through something and every, everyone, I've, everyone on the project, I think has, has a very personal reason that they're doing it. Mm -hmm.